channel so as you can probably tell by the title of this video it's all about what I've bought recently it's just a little bit of a haul really just to kind of show you what I've bought recently and yeah sorry about this eyelash it really is starting to annoy me already but yeah hopefully it's just not going to annoy you too much and it's not going to keep poking in me like but yes yeah, so I'm just going to quickly showing you just going to quickly be showing you I don't know if that really made sense but I'm just going to be showing you really what I've bought recently I did say in one of my recent vlogs I think it was my Canterbury one that I was thinking of doing one of these so I mean here it is, I decided to do it. So if you want to see what I've purchased recently, then just keep watching. So since I mentioned in the Canterbury vlog that I might be doing one of these really, I thought it might only be right just to show you what I bought in Canterbury first. So the first item that I'm going to be showing you in this kind of haul kind of video is some boots. Now I actually got some boots because I actually needed some new ones, I mean, it's genuinely why you buy stuff really because you need them. I just got these um, kind of black chunky heeled um boots from new these are actually from new look i got them from new look and they were 27.99 full price I haven't actually worn them yet by the time i'm filming this but um i actually managed to pick them up on one of new looks 20 percent off those so i think there was about 20 pounds something like that which isn't too bad really because i kind of wear these if i'm just going like out locally and i'm not going out like too dressy like if we're just going out locally with me and my friends and I don't know, we're just going for a few drinks or something then. We don't tend to get that dressed up. It's only when we go a bit further afield that we get like really, really dressed up. And these shoes are a great alternative to wearing actual high-heeled shoes just for like a night out round by me, really. I mean, they've got quite a thick heel on, as you can see. So, I mean, they're quite sturdy. not going to be folding over or anything like that in them. But, yeah, I'm just going to be wearing these locally, really. So, I'm really pleased that I got them. So, sticking with the shoe kind of vibe from this haul, um, I have got one more pair of shoes to show you. And I did actually manage to pick this pair up on Black Friday. So I think I got like 20 or 30% off. It was quite a good bargain. But I got them from Adidas. I actually picked them up from the office. Um, like from the website office. I mean they obviously have like stores and stuff. But yeah that's, that's just where I picked these ones up. And they are the Adidas. I think they're called... I don't know why we keep like focusing for no reason but i think these are called adidas continental 80s or something like that they just kind of look like this and that's just kind of what the shoes look like they're just a trainer really and i absolutely love wearing trainers like i literally live in them like day to day kind of wear really just because i mean they're super comfortable they don't really tend to give me blisters that much and i mean i'm all for trainers really they're just super super comfortable and i did actually need a fresh white pair because i mean white trainers and me they don't really stay white that long i mean i always end up like stepping in puddles this time of year or just genuinely getting them dirty from like wear and tear really so yeah i definitely needed a new fresh white pair but yeah they are the second pair of shoes i got sorry it keeps like auto focus i don't really know why i don't know if i've like accidentally like clicked a button or something so if we keep focusing like in and out i can't really do anything about it really i don't know why it keeps like flashing up at the top of the camera I mean you can't really see what it's doing but I mean I can keep seeing that it keeps like putting me out of focus but I mean hopefully it's not going to annoy you too much so yeah so they were the second pair of shoes that I got for this haul and I actually managed to pick them up in the kids section which is quite handy I mean I always seem to find that like I'm like the last size of like trainer size that they kind of do in the kids so I I managed to get my trainers quite cheap really but yeah I managed I got did actually get them ones in the kids section as well because I'm like a size five so or I wear size five trainers so I mean perfect because I mean don't know if I had up prices for them and what was really good was that the office junior section which is where they were from actually had like 12 I can't remember if it was 20 or 30 percent off as well so I literally got them for like I think it was like £39 or something stupid and in the adult section they're like 70 80 quid like I'm not even joking I saved an absolute fortune really but yeah they was an absolute bargain so I mean sorry if your feet aren't like in the see done it again I don't really know what it's doing there definitely need to like figure out why it keeps on doing that I'm not entirely sure look there we go again am I like moving slightly I'm not sure it's gonna annoy me though but um yeah, I did manage to pick them ones up from the kids section and it's really really pleased that my feet didn't grow past the size 5 really but yeah I'm definitely going to get loads and loads of wear out of them so moving on to the next item in this kind of what I've bought recently haul and the rest of these items were actually picked up over the Black Friday weekend so I mean I know those trainers were and the only thing that wasn't was those heels but yeah the rest of this stuff I did actually pick up over the Black Friday weekend so I didn't actually pay full price for it quite luckily so the next item that I picked up 
was actually from Marks and Spencers. Now I don't typically buy stuff in Marks and Spencers just because I mean I don't really feel like it's my kind of age range or I mean or maybe it's I just genuinely don't seem to find anything in there really but I saw this from their autograph um like range and I just thought that it was just going to be perfect really for what I kind of needed it for so it is just a plain white shirt and it's kind of one of those things that literally you kind of just like layer things under that's why I really bought it I don't tend to wear like white shirts just like as a white shirt really I don't know if that really makes sense but what I'm basically trying to say is that I only normally wear white shirts if I'm putting it under something so like I'll just have like the collar sticking out really I could get one of those like collar things but the reason that I didn't get one of those like shirt kind of things that just kind of slip under your jumper is basically because especially this time of year I get really really cold so I kind of need like an extra layer all over because otherwise I'm gonna end up like freezing half to death and what I really like about MS shirts is that they literally seem to iron and last really really well i mean i haven't actually had like an adult shirt from them before but when i was in school i always seemed to get like my school skirt and school shirts from MS, and they always seem to last like pretty much the whole year and they always used to like wash really well and iron quite well so i mean this one definitely feels like it's gonna do both of them things it's definitely a nice material like it's quite thick and especially this time of year like like I say I get freezing so I definitely need like an extra kind of not an extra layer I literally wear like three or four layers I'm not even gonna lie but need to make sure that I'm nice and warm this autumn winter kind of period but yeah I absolutely love that shirt and I'm sure I'm gonna get plenty of wear out of it so the next item from this haul I actually picked up from Reese um I actually picked up from the outlet section of their website um basically if you go on like Reese's website they have like an outlet section on their website like all year round and it's basically got all the stuff that's in like the outlet stores they just seem to have online as well really so um, I actually managed to pick this um crew jumper up and it kind of has like ruffled details right from like the top right down to the armpits on each side so it's really really cute just gives a little bit more detail and it's just kind of like this navy colour it's really really soft and this is kind of the thing that I'd like put a shirt underneath just because I mean it's a little bit plain without anything underneath it just adds like a little bit extra of shirt underneath things like this and this is just kind of how I kind of wear it really but yeah I picked this up in a size small is it small? yeah it's the small if you bought this when it was like brand new in season it was £120 and I actually managed to pick it up for 65 which I don't think is that bad for something from Reese because they actually last ages. Like it washes really well, like your cost per wear is literally nothing by the amount of times that I have wear it. And I'm kind of one of them people that literally re-wears everything season after season until literally you can't wear it anymore. So I know that this is actually going to be money well spent. But yeah, it is super, super soft and I absolutely love it really. So yeah, that is the fourth item from this kind of haul really. And the last item that I'm going to be showing you in today's haul is a jumper that I absolutely love. And it's actually really, really thick as well. It's like this kind of green khaki kind of colour. And it has got all of this like cross detailing. So it's got like detailing that goes down on this side. And then on this side, I don't know how much you can actually see. But the detailing kind of goes across. And I've tried this on. I haven't actually worn it out yet but it is super super flattering like it's just one of them jumpers that you put on and I'm just like oh my god I love it literally like I fell in love straight away to be honest with you it's from a brand called Me and M and it is just like super super cosy it's so so thick and literally I absolutely love it it's also got like this detailing on the um arms as well so it goes right the way down and these sleeves are super super long especially for someone of my height because I'm like five foot eight and nothing's ever normally that long on me so for me I can even roll the sleeves over just because it's like super oversized I mean I did pick up in a size small yeah I picked up in a size small just because I mean it's oversized anyway and as I mentioned this jumper is actually from uh, me and M and I hadn't actually heard of this uh, brand like at all really and from what I gather it is quite new but I mean I absolutely love it they've got like loads of like knitwear and stuff that looks really really cosy on their website so I might end up ordering a few more bits I'm not entirely sure yet but yeah it is from me and them like I said and I actually heard about this brand through um, in the throat on I'm sure you've heard of her she's like a massive youtuber but yeah and she kind of had a discount code for Black Friday definitely put that in just to save myself 20% really but yeah I absolutely love this and it's gonna get so much well over this like winter kind of period 
But yeah, it's one of those jumpers that are literally like so thick, you can literally like cose yourself into them. But yeah, I'm literally obsessive, I'm gonna get so much out of it. And the other thing I would say about this jumper is that it feels like the quality is also super, super good. It feels like it's gonna wash really well. And um, as you can probably tell, I'm all for things that are gonna like last ages. I can just wear season after season and they're not gonna kind of like go out of fashion really. But yeah, so I absolutely love this and I know I'm going to get tons and tons of wear out of it. But yeah, that was the fifth and final item from this kind of end of November, December haul really. I mean, this is definitely going up in December. I definitely think that I've got a right bargain on some of the items and I'm literally going to get so, so much wear out of pretty much all of it really. But yeah, they were the five items from this kind of what I've recently bought. I'll probably do another one of these like in January, February time. February. I'll probably do another video like this around January, February time if any of you are interested. But yeah, I do really hope you enjoyed what I thought recently. If you did, please smash a massive thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't already. But yeah, until next time guys, see ya!